someone wants you to know I've kid donated $50,000 to help immigrant kids. As outrage swelled over Donald Trump's uniquely cruel policy of separating immigrant children from their parents and throwing said children in cages, many paused and thought to themselves, wait a second, isn't there a senior White House employee with the president's ear who's supposedly all about advocating for families? The answer was, well, sort of. Lately, sentient nude pump Ivanka Trump has had her hands full posting tone-deaf photos on Instagram and making up Chinese proverbs on Twitter, which doesn't leave a lot of time for speaking out against unimaginable cruelty. Behind the scenes, the first daughter turned senior advisor apparently mentioned something to the president about the whole thing, something along the lines of, Daddy, what are we doing about this? Her father recalled during a recent Hill meeting, but her worries appeared more rooted in the fact that images of traumatized children do not make for great PR and speaking of PR, someone wants us to know that Ivka donated a bunch of money to a pastor who's dealing with the problem daddy created, an evangelical leader who asked to not be named tell CBN News Ivka Trump donated $50,000 to a church in Plano, Texas, after hearing about its efforts to help immigrant children at the southern border. The source says President Trump's daughter learned about Prestonwood Baptist Church and its outreach on Twitter. The source tells CBN News Ivanka Trump reached out to Pastor Jack Graham and made the private donation before the announcement of her father's executive order, which takes steps to keep immigrant families together at the border. So, that's nice. Not as nice as taking a vocal stand against an administration with a horrible attitude toward immigrants and refugees, but it's a start. Still, one wonders how word of this secret donation made its way to the media. While we would never suggest that someone in Javanka's personal press shop was the source here, some might note that it's become a regular occurrence for reports portraying Ivka in a light that doesn't hurt shoe and handbag sales to surface around the time she's being called out in the press for her deafening silence. See, Charlottesville? Anyway, that's all water under the bridge, so let's join the president's daughter in thanking the president for putting a stop to the policy his own attorney general enacted in April. Follow to get the latest news and analysis about the players in your inbox. HTTPS colon slash slash Twitter dot com slash Imka Trump slash status slash one oh nine five one eight four nine oh four oh one eight one two four eight one